Welcome to the Showstopper Shows. This is the new cold brew frozen coffee from McDonald's. Let's taste it. We ain't never quit. Y'all, I've seen this online that it was coming out very soon, and I am so excited to taste it for you. Go ahead and insert straw and take a taste of this new beverage from McDonald's. Wow. Let's break that down. First off, I, it's raining outside, so if you hear some rain, that's what you're hearing. If I ask them to add caramel to this, I love caramel frozen coffees from Dunkin' Donuts. They're very good, they're very tasty. Starbucks has frozen coffee. Chick-fil-A has also done frozen coffees. Dunkin' Donuts has the best one I've ever tasted so far. Now, break it down to this one. That one is really good. This taste is basically the McDonald's coffee frozen and it's and it's cold brew cold brew is coffee that's brewed cold obviously it has to be brewed over a longer period of time and therefore it holds more of its caffeine content and a little bit of a stronger flavor and this actually has a very strong coffee flavor and it tastes really good and it's actually it's you can tell it's got some sweetener in it but it's not very sweet at all it's got more of a coffee flavor but it's more of a of a bitter sweet coffee flavor and it's more toned down that is one of the best coffee flavors i can think of right now that i'm tasting we do another one wow well, I've also Googled the nutrition information of this too. The only thing I could really find was on the board there, which was 360 calories in this coffee, but nothing else so far. I've been looking up a caffeine content, how much sugar, that kind of thing. Again, I asked for them to add caramel to this, which I'm kind of glad they didn't because I just got to taste the coffee flavor. And usually when they add caramel at McDonald's to their drinks, as you've seen in my previous McDonald's coffee reviews, the macchiatos, they add way too much ca uh, caramel. So they probably would have done that to this too. This has a great flavor, guys. I'm, I know I'm talking a lot here, but I'm seriously amazed at how good the cold brew frozen coffee from McDonald's tastes. And I got this for free because I use the app. And I'm gonna tell you something, I can really feel that caffeine already kicking in. That is some good frozen coffee. Lastly, before I get to my rating, I love the texture of this frozen coffee. It kind of reminds me of a frappuccino, but also of a shake. So it's kind of in between both of those. It's a little thicker than a frappuccino, but a little thinner than a shake. And I love, love, love that texture. And how weird is it? Side note, as I look back at my previous macchiato review, I had the same transaction number. Let me give you my rating. That is certainly a showstopper sizzle. And believe it or not, I'm giving that a 10 out of 10. That is perfect. $3.59 for the large, it's $2 for that small, and then they have the medium that's kind of in between right there. That is really, really good. I can't say enough about that. Kudos to McDonald's. They are stepping up their coffee game, and that is the best one of all the coffee drinks I have tasted that they've come out with, by far. So if that helps you out at all, if you see it up on the sign, and you go watch the Showstopper shows, you'll know what to do. Thanks to everybody who's been commenting on my uh, pickle juice slush video. You guys are great. So I've gotten a lot of comments on my Facebook posts about it. People saying, ooh, that's gross, that makes me sick. There's other people saying they love it. So no, it's just a lot of stuff going on. Guys, thanks for watching. May the forks be with you. May his presence be with you. Always put a ball in this video because that's a wrap. The show stops here. Never quit, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. I got to get in and keep drinking this because it's so good. And it's raining, so it finally stopped. The show stops here. Never quit, y'all. We ain't never going to quit it. <laughs>